happened there. You have many, your paintings have many faces and expressions. Um, if I sit every night, no, not every night, when I'm sometimes sitting in my living room, once or twice, once or twice a week, if I'm watching the TV, it's, it's so that uh, in the parliament in Denmark and in the ministry, you can choose how you uh, decorate your office. And normally, Danish politicians can choose from a catalog, from the from the Danish uh, art museum, Danish museum of course, uh, where we can choose uh, pictures. And a lot of the good pictures are already hanging in some of the politicians' offices, in some of the meeting room in Christians Four. And the, my uh, the former Minister of Justice, he is born and raised in the Bornholm. So he had a bon home painter, and that was fine. But, <laughs> but, but a little too dark for me. Uh, a little too dark for me. Then it, at the summertime, the office was painted, and I had to choose some pictures. And I got the catalog from what was left from the Danish uh, museum. I just went through it, and it was just dark, dark, dark pictures. And I said, if I'm not getting suicidal, I have to do something else. <laughs> because it's just dark pictures. I have to, when, you have, when you walk into a room in an office and, and you have the art on the walls, it should, it should give something, uh, it should amaze you, it should say something to you, you should debate it, you should ask about it. And you don't ask about just a dark picture. And that's, uh, well, not, not, I do not, uh, but, but then I called uh, Tom and I said to him, do you think there's any possibilities that uh, we can uh, we can hang some pictures uh, in my office? The good thing is there's absolutely no money in it, <laughs> and uh, because I can't do, or else I'll get in the front of the page or, or, or the paper. That's for sure. So, uh, and he said, let's talk about it. And uh, and what is interesting is that. Since they have been hanged, the pictures, whenever people come to my office, they always stop to look at the four pictures and then ask about them. They ask about them. We have a talk. Actually, if you're meeting with somebody, you know this is going to be maybe a not so good meeting. <laughs> uh, you start by maybe uh, they talk about this, ask about what these four pictures people ask about in many ways. And, that's what art is meant to be, you know, things. When um, I'm doing some, some interviews in my office, when, I, when it's in my office, the cameramen always come in and they have a very clear idea of what, where, where should it be and stuff. They look around and in a few seconds they say, okay, <laughs> I stand here, you know, this and they almost do it every time, maybe you have seen it, some of you. Uh, so that's that's very cool, and I think maybe it's. Uh, I hope people think it's a beautiful picture. So if I'm under a lot of pressure, maybe people don't listen to what I say. They just <laughs> <laughs> look at, the, look at the, the, the picture. But I say, if I had money, I would buy some of, the, <laughs> some of these paintings. Well, I hope you get them all sold because this is this is once again amazing what you have done. Uh, I'm looking forward to when you're turning 50. Uh, <laughs> I, I myself have a, another uh, attitude to that. Uh, years ago I thought 50, that was almost end of life. Now it's <laughs> how I have it. Oh, it's just the new 40s thing. Uh, it's kind of way. So we agree on that one. But, uh, okay. <laughs> 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 I think you're